Blaine Park Patrol has been around for many years with the City of Blaine. We operate out of the Park and Rec Department. Uh, all of our officers are reserve officers with the City of Blaine Police Department. I have been with the Blaine Park Patrol since 2006, uh, patrolling the parks here on a seasonal basis. We start in May and operate through the end of October. Uh, what we're going to go over with you today is just a few things on what Park Patrol does, who we are, and common courtesies and practices that we'd like everyone to enjoy. When you see us out and about inside the parks, all of our officers, please feel free to come out to our vehicle, say hi, ask us a few questions. We're more than happy to answer any questions that you may have about the City of Blaine or the Park and Rec Department itself. The officers that we have on the Park Patrol are reserve officers with the City of Blaine Police Department. Uh, not all of them are criminal justice type school students. Uh, they are volunteers from the community that just choose to volunteer their time with the department to assist other officers and to assist the community at whole during a variety of community events from the Blazing Fourth Parade uh, to different events that the city has around town throughout the year. Uh, currently we have four officers that work uh, the park and rec during the seasonal time from May to October and those officers are normally the same to same every year uh, but different officers are allowed the opportunity uh, to work with the park patrol and that's decided by the reserve sergeant. A typical day for the park patrol officer uh, starts with uh, shift briefing at the police department. Uh, we gather our gear and our vehicle. Uh, all of our stuff is kept at the Blaine Police Department headquarters. The shift briefing is just to notify the on-duty supervisor, the sergeant that's on duty, that we are out and about uh, during the parks, so he has awareness of us. Also, for anything that may happen during the previous day or during the time period prior to our shift of anything notable inside the parks or in the area that we may need to be aware of from a missing child, missing person, or other suspicious activity that may be happening. Right now I'd like to talk about some of our trail etiquette and trails that we have within the city of Blaine. The city of Blaine has the luxury of many multiple miles of paved trail without the city uh, here at Loch Ness Park and other parks around the city. A few things that we'd like to stress to everyone that's using the park, your bike riders, our rollerbladers, our runners, and our dog walkers. Please be respectful of each other and our space. Uh, keep to the right just like we would on any major highway. And watch for your dog and what your dog is doing. Reminder, we always like to keep up and pick up after our dogs and keep them on a leash at all times while they're aboard a public park.